ball game. <laughs> I love how I keep replaying this one. I'm so sorry. I recognize how boring this must be. So I'm hoping that just stories about myself as time goes on is going to be enough. Also, I'm wondering if I should... Yeah, no, I decided that I'm just going to start posting this as I go along. Good job. And now, for your listening pleasure, ball game. So yeah, as soon as I'm done posting up Arthur, that's when I'm going to start, like, posting this up alongside Nancy Drew. Because why not? Ball game. Why not? Okay. Okay. Plus, honestly, I think we care more about, like, the adventures and what we, like, see and learn along the way and, like, the postcards that we get and the stamps that we collect. We don't really give a shit about listening to this over and over again. Maybe the stories, like, the Mad Lib stories. I really enjoy those. You did it! Let's rock! I'll try to, like, change it up every once in a while. But especially when I'm just wanting to get a stamp, I'm just gonna do this over and over again, honestly. Like, maybe while I'm doing an adventure, I'll do something new. But other than that, who cares, really? Ball game. I understand if that's not what you're looking for. But at the same time, it's Jumpstart Second Grade. What else are you hoping for in this? What? What? Like, are we looking to learn here? I mean, we can learn stuff about the states and, like, stamps and stuff, so that's chill. Good job. Let's rock! Mm -mm. Ooh! One more and then we're at a stamp. Oh, I wanted to check something. Um, Ball game. as soon as we're done with an adventure, one dollar. I'm gonna try playing the fruit thing again. Except on trailblazer mode. Wait, I don't think I can then. So how are they going to make a memory game harder? More fruit? Probably. You just got a stamp of... James A. Garfield. Damn! We all about the presidents. You just added a stamp to your collection. Sweet. You did it! Let's rock! Yas. <laughs> Alright. Let's get an adventure. And then, as soon as it's done, I'm going to sign off for the day. Dear Pen Pal, I am Michael, writing from Arizona. Oh dear. Can you draw me a picture of the famous artwork, The Mona Lisa, by Leonardo da Vinci? I am doing a book report for school. Thanks, Michael. What? You can choose to work on this Pen Pal challenge, or you can look at another. Click on the play envelope if you want to accept this challenge. Click on the next envelope if you want to read another pen pal letter. Y'all, it's been a hot second since I've been in like elementary school or junior high or high school where you have to do a book report, which I'm pretty sure the last time I did a book report, I'm pretty sure it was like either elementary school or junior high. But if I remember correctly, I don't think... For a book report, someone drawing a... whatever. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, that'll be a challenge, all right. Damn straight it will. That's a cool challenge. Well... There's an easel in the classroom. I bet you can make your picture there. That will be the a challenge. The elevator can take you to the location that'll help you solve your challenge. Yeah, that will be a challenge. Draw a most famous painting, like one of the most famous paintings in the world. Please. And thank you. You can solve your challenge in the classroom. Click on that floor. Okay, there was a way to do this. There was a way to do this that I don't remember. Let's see. I think your pen pal is looking for a picture of the Mona Lisa. Great works. I saw that picture in the Great Works book. Okay. Click one that you'd like to color. Oh. Oh, so I literally just like... Oh, how fun. Okay. Brown. 
Do I have to color it in? Can't I use like, yes, there we go. There we go. I honestly forget what she looks like. Um, Orange. Oh, I have You're to... a great artist. I literally am just splashing stuff on. Yep. <laughs> that looks exactly like her, guys. <laughs> oh, I can mix colors. Oh, Red. yes. Let's <laughs> You're a great artist. Let's make everything purple. Purple. This is ridiculous. Oh. This is fucking gorgeous. <laughs> it's really not that funny. <laughs> I just find it hysterical. Oh boy, oh boy. Let's go back to orange. Did you see that? <laughs> the question mark disappeared. Hey, you've solved the challenge. You'll have to send a reply to your pen pal. Click on the letter icon to get back to the mail room. Hold on. I'm not done with my masterpiece. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. You know what? <laughs> no, I gotta finish this. I have to finish this. Hold on. Let's make this green. Red. Blue. There we go. Green. What will all of mixing this together make? So, hold on. Let's make this all green. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. That's what blue is supposed to be. But okay, what will like blue and brown, blue and brown do? What is this? Brown, green. Brown. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Black. Dark blue. That's fair. White. Light blue. Okay, let's use light blue. Gorgeous. Okay. Yellow. Oh, that's green. Okay. And that's purple. So let's move on then to... Brown. Red. What is this? Red brown. You know what? That's your hair color. Perfection. Love that for you. Why does it look like she's being painted during the Christmas time? Black. Dark red. There we go. Okay. Gr White. Ooh, pink. Pink. Hell yeah. Gorgeous girl. Absolutely stunning. Fetching. Forget whatever you wore before. This. This is how you gotta be. 100%. Okay, let's see. Yellow. Oh, that's right, orange. Right. Okay, so we're done with that. Um, yellow. Great job. Really? White. Fuck off. What is this? Light yellow. That's true. Black. Dark yellow. Right. Brown. Yellow brown. Well, fuck off, yellow brown. Okay. Um. Brown. Brown. I think it's everything's done, really. Let's use yellow brown for everything. Oh, actually, there's nothing really here yellow brown that I want. That sounds disgusting, yellow brown. And I can't do dark green either, can I? Well, blue. It is what it is. Let's do this. I hate all of this. You know what? I think I'm done. This is beautiful. This is gorgeous. Hey, Picasso. If you want to save this masterpiece before leaving, I really don't. click on save. I really don't. Otherwise, click on the arrow there and you'll be done. That's no, that's fine. Please, please do something before Frogface gets back on the adventure kick. All right. The elevator can take us on all kinds of adventures. Okay. The clubhouse. We're going back to the concentration game. Click on the... Oh, no. That's not what I if wanted. You solve your hey. All right. No. Okay. That's wild. Click on the mail room and Mr. Brewster will help you get started on an adventurous... Well, then, I guess we're rounding this off with uh, more jukebox nonsense. Ball game. Should I go to the bone vault? Maybe I should go to the bone vault. Since I don't know what's in there anymore. You did it. Let's rock! Yeah, let's go to the Bone Vault. Only five points for the fucking concentration game? You gotta be shitting me. 
Ugh, what should I do? Um, let's play this game again and make it a uh, trailblazer mode. Horrible alien. Okay. Now click on the correct planet. Can you get to the eighth planet from the sun before the aliens do? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oops. Oh, eight. Cause Can Pluto. You get to Fuck off. Neptune. Good job. Pilot to co-pilot. We know what's gonna happen. That's right, Pluto is still planet. Brr. Oh, it's fucking cold. And we have No, Trailblazer. I'm a trailblazer. Alright, let's make this complicated as fuck. This hasn't changed! Why do we need to show this again? This hasn't changed a bit. And we have touchdown! Yep. Welcome to Neptune! Thanks. Lieutenant Edison, ready for spacewalk? My toes are tapping. All right, we're at 17. Commence spacewalk! <sighs> Ooh, a little nippy out here. Lieutenant, any sign of aliens? Not yet, sir. We'll use this chart to monitor the number of aliens that land on the planet. Be very careful. If five aliens land, then the planet will be invaded. The yellow column shows how many aliens you have defeated. Keep an eye on it as you defend the planet. Ready to deploy land cruiser. Why do I feel like it's going to be like Roger, Commander. super, super fast? You can control the land cruiser by using your left and right arrow keys. Use the space bar to fire. All right, let's do this. Alert, alert. Aliens approaching. Get ready. Here they come. Fire! Okay, let's faster. Oh. They're dropping little bits of shit, too. Great job. Oh, and there's meteors. Those look like the little, like, turkey balls Great that I had job. earlier. Sir, another wave of aliens approaching. What are these little bits of dust? Oh, yeah, they fuck you up. They fuck you up, for sure. Sir, another wave of aliens approaching. Alrighty. You did it. So if we get oh that's a big boy. Oh, I can disintegrate it. Great job. So if I get to 32 points, that means that uh, I get the same amount from oh no, one's about to land. That means I get the same amount as from the jukebox. And so that would make the jukebox a little bit more worth it. I mean, this isn't bad as, like, an every once in a while, like, distraction, I guess. But if I had to choose one, I would choose a jukebox because it's, like, achieved so much- Oh, check that out! Oh, no. I would prefer the jukebox, though. Because it's so much easier and faster. Oh, fuck, there's five of them. All right. We might actually have a landing in a second. Because I think there's... Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. He's about to land! Oh. Oh. There's a whole horde of them. Y'all, it's almost the holidays. I am so stoked. Pair that... Oh my god. Pair that with, like, possibly getting a job. Ugh. Best Christmas present ever. Maybe I should watch a Christmas movie tonight. Yas. 32? The Intergalactic Alien Task Force will be proud. Fuck off. Nope. I'm going back to the jukebox. This is some nonsense. Absolute nonsense. What? If there's gonna be so much effort put into it, then like, why don't it award me more more points? Good job. Look at that. Let's rock. And look at that. I didn't have to choose a planet. I didn't have to go into playing like or playing attacking aliens. Ridiculous. Nope. Ball game. Y'all, from now on, I might just be like doing um, adventures and then jukebox. That might be it.
I hate it just as much as y'all probably do, but let's just pretend we're here to learn about my life <laughs> and how I am. Good job. Let's rock. We'll learn about states and stamps. That's pretty nifty. And we'll learn about my life and how things are going. Ball game. I'll find my new game and I'll play this in between games, like in between playing that game. And you'll have like a little update on my life like during the game as well too. Although if I'm playing a game, I'll probably update you on my life there too. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing anymore. Good job. I have no idea. And now for your listening pleasure, ball game. Like who fucking knows what they're doing? <laughs> Does anyone? Cause I don't. Alrighty. I really, really still hate that it's ball game. 77 and not like 75 or 80. It pains me. It gives me stomach aches. You did it! Let's rock! Take me out to the ball game. Still love how shoe fly like. That blew my mind. Haven't heard that song in forever, and I completely forgot, like, the meaning of it. Ball game. Alrighty, we're about to get One our last stamp of the day. Yas, bitch! Mm. You just got a stamp of Star 51 Pegasus. What? You just added a stamp to your collection. Ooh. Click on a stamp to see it animate. Okay. If you want more stamps, try playing some games and act. So it looks like we're getting rid of one of the presidents then. This yep. section is for. We're getting rid of one of the presidents. This. James A. Garfield. I guess we're getting rid of James A. Garfield. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's find out about James Garfield. James A. Garfield. Garfield attacked political dishonesty during his presidency. Well, thank you. That gave me all the information I need to know about him. Well, that's a good choice. Oh, the hits are freezing. Well, let's write a letter. How about something like this? Dear Michael, I am sending you a copy of the Mona Lisa. I colored it myself. <laughs> your pal. So funny. I'll send your letter right away. Woo. Do, do, do. The mailman is coming here on his way. What will the mailman bring you today? All right, let's hear it. Tell me how pretty my picture is. I shouldn't laugh, honestly. Why is he asking me for one? He could literally go to the library. Attention! A postcard has just arrived from... Arizona, right? Arizona! Hell yeah. You get to light up a new state. There we go. Good job. Dear Pen Pal, thanks for the picture. It really helped. I got an A on my report. Your friend. Michael. I think it might be because of you, not because of my picture. Still had to write the report. Arizona. There are many trails in Arizona's Grand Canyon. Well, cool. Michael, I hope you're doing well. I've never been to the Grand Canyon, but it looks very steep. No, I do. I, I have heard that it's absolutely gorgeous and wonderful. Um, so one of these days I'll definitely make it out there. Um, but yeah, Michael, I hope you're enjoying yourself in Arizona. Um, I hear it's a great place to buy a house. Um, definitely, you know, more, more affordable, um, house purchasing options than here in California, or at least in my part of California. But um, yeah, I hope you're doing great over in Arizona. And shout out to everyone who, so far, we've collected. So shout out to everyone in Arizona, Arkansas, Florida, Georgia, North Carolina, and New York. Shout out to everyone who lives there. And then, you know, eventually as I keep lighting stuff up, I'll do shout outs for that. But I think I'm going to go now. 
Uh, thanks for following along. Hope you guys understand that I'm just going to stick with the jukebox. <laughs> and I'll talk to y'all and see y'all next time. Bye.